It's Pelleo today, and in today's tutorial, I'm going to be showing you guys how to make this dark night kind of flicker here. I thought it was very, very cool and unique. And I'm going to be showing you guys some new techniques and new effects to add on your flicker effects to make them a little bit more cooler, in my opinion. So I'm excited to show you guys how to make the effect. And if you guys don't know, I run the Editing Visuals website where I have a bunch of editing packs that's going to help you out with your editing, so if that sounds interesting to you, feel free to check out my website. Now let's get into the tutorials. So here we're in After Effects, I've added the footage I'm going to be showcasing this effect on, and we are yeah simply just going to be making a adjustment layer. Very very simple here, and yeah to make a adjustment layer you're just going to be pressing Ctrl Alt Y. So here we're going to start off by adding Vignette, and I'm going to be using the default uh, After Effects default settings here, I'm not going to change anything for the moment. You guys can adjust if there's uh, if you guys want later. After that, I'm going to be adding noise. I'm gonna set the amount of noise to 30%, so we get this kind of grungy look to it. After that, I'm going to be adding time, warp RGB, and here I'm going to be using the default settings here. I think this is a pretty pretty cool effect. It's going to look something like this, adding these uh, RGB ghostings, kind of. Uh, I think it looks very very good. After that, I'm going to be adding sapphire hotspots. And here I'm going to be decreasing the threshold to 0.2. Get this look here. Looks uh, pretty dark and cool. After that I'm going to be adding flicker. Here I'm going to increase the amplitude to 0.5. And then I'm going to increase the random color amplitude to 0.3. And this is going to give you this flickering effect here. Pretty, pretty clean. And to top it off I'm going to be adding deep glow. Here set the radius to 650. And then the exposure to 0.3. Seven. And here you're going to get this cool looking night flicker effect. You don't need to use the RGB if you guys don't want. That's just my personal taste. I think it looks cool adding that effect. But if you don't want to have it, it's going to be looking something like this instead. Still insanely, insanely clean. So uh, yeah, I'm pretty satisfied with this effect. Now, if you guys don't know, my great friend Poikas, he have made a flicker presets pack, which I'm going to be showing you guys now so if you guys like this kind of effect here this flicker effect you guys are definitely going to like Povika's flicker presets pack so if I just make a new adjustment layer called Y then go to animation presets use presets flicker presets here we have a bunch of flicker presets I could add the flicker grunge ultimate and this is how it's going to look really really cool in my opinion it has this kind of CRT, grunge, flickering, distortion, all at the same time. I think it's a really, really cool effect. We have flicker echo grunge. It's going to give you guys this look here, a really cool neon flickering effect. Very, very trippy. The last effect I'm going to be showing you guys is the flicker distort one. And it's going to look something like this. Black and white flickering distortion. Very clean effect. And if you guys are interested in this pack, I'm going to be leaving a link to it in the description. And you guys could actually use the discount code PELLE to save $5 on this pack. If you guys want to save this as a preset now, you can just mark all the effects by pressing Ctrl A. Go to animation, save animation preset, then press save. And your preset will be saved so you guys could use it for another time. And if you guys like this tutorial, don't forget to like and subscribe and share this tutorial. Don't forget to comment on this tutorial, what you liked about the tutorial and what tutorials you guys want next. And also don't forget to check out my website, editingvisuals.com, check out my socials, join my Discord server, and I'll see you guys soon. Take care, and have a nice day.